Mr. President, it's uh, an old established tradition that uh, Shamrock is presented to the President of the United States on St. Patrick's Day. Hope I can get this pin out. And uh, this reflects the ties of kinship between the Irish in our island and the Irish here in the United States, of whom you, sir, are uh, the great representative. Thank you. And uh, St. Patrick's Day is uh, a day which reminds us all of these ties of kinship and affection. This year in particular, we recall with special pleasure your own visit to uh, Ireland, uh, your visit uh, to Galway, my own hometown, sir, where you were given the freedom of the city and your stay in Ashford Castle. Uh, this year is also the 800th anniversary of the city of Cork, an ancient seaport town in the south of Ireland. Uh, with a long tradition of silver making. Indeed, it is said, uh, legend has it, that uh, St. Finbar, the patron of Cork, and in a way the founder of the original settlement there, was himself a silversmith. And to commemorate the 800th anniversary of the city of Cork, I present to you, sir, on behalf of all citizens of Cork and all Irish people, this silver dish. Thank you. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. And I would like in return to present to you, before I my remarks, this letter. And you will notice that there is a very special letterhead on this White House stationery. I'm Tach Bond. Isn't that nice? Well, I'm pleased that we could get together since on St. Patrick's Day, uh, we will be out of town. As a matter of fact, we'll be out of the country. But I'm always happy to send, spend St. Patrick's Day with great Irishmen and reciprocate the warm hospitality that greeted us on our trip to Ireland last year. And concerning Northern Ireland, I applaud and encourage the active Anglo-Irish dialogue and support all those who are working for peaceful reconciliation there and among them. Very much, pro very prominently is Ambassador Tag O'Sullivan, who's working for that reconciliation. I'm honored to receive this shamrock and will wear it as an expression of my hope for peace and goodwill in the year ahead. Friendship with Ireland and the Irish people is deep and enduring. I understand that this bowl here has, as we've been told, a special historical meaning for the city of Cork. Uh, it has a little historical meaning for me also because I understand that the Clan Reagan is very prominent in Cork and in that city. To add some special flavor now, I would like to have a presentation made to the ambassador. Girl Scout cookies are world famous. And here in emerald uniform are some representatives of the Girl Scouts. And one of them is going to present Girl Scout cookies to the ambassador. Thank you. You have done it already. <laughs> Stand there. Right. We'll do it again, what? Right? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, yes, just put right. it there. Thank you. Now, because I'm thank afraid that much. those people with the cameras thank didn't you. see you. <laughs> well, thank you very much, and thank you all for thank being here. Thank you, girls. Thank Appreciate thank it. You. I didn't know you. Are those special uniforms for the day? <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, thank you all for being here, and thank you, Mr. Ambassador. Thank you, 
very proud to have this. Thank you, Thank right. you very much. <laughs> this is an Irish day. We're only talking about Irish who are already here. <laughs> I hadn't thought of it, but it's an idea. <laughs> thank you, sir. Well, girl, thank you. All very much. It would be a great honor to me if you would give me a hug. Give me your hand. Give me your hand.